Hey everybody, this is Rhino, and we are back for another episode of Tales from the Borderlands. And we will be starting another episode of Tales from the Borderlands, episode 3 of this game, Catch a Ride. Uh, we will see it previously on, so we can recap where we were and the choices we made. As I press the controller, all the menu options change. So let's begin and play episode 3. Back so soon? What's the rush? Okay, okay, sit down, shut up, and pay attention. The misfit vault hunters had discovered the secret location of the Gortis project, but getting there wouldn't be easy. Hyperion had not forgotten about their renegade employees, and the native Pandoran wildlife was, uh, just getting to know them. They escaped with their lives, but not much else. Out in the wasteland, the former middle manager discovered Handsome Jack riding shotgun in his brain while having a shotgun pointed at his head. Fancy meeting you a precarious position, to be sure, but nothing compared to the con artist. The price on her head had attracted all kinds of thugs and gunmen. Even a legendary vault hunter had joined the pursuit. You'd think that would have been the end of her story. But it turns out that even legends struggle with the demands of a personal life. Not as much as I miss Back Jamie. on the trail of the Gortis project, they found a wondrous hidden city, risen from the corpse of a ghost town. But unfortunately, their moment of awe and victory was to be the advantage of their opponents. <laughs> sure. Taken hostage and forced to surrender the keys to the kingdom, they had to go all in on one last gamble. This chapter of the story begins with the questionable choice to trust Handsome Jack. Very much a questionable choice. Old Haven was a pretty small area in Borderlands 1. To have a secret facility under it, I guess kind of expands that myth a little bit. So, you chose a bonafide nutcase over Fiona? Yes, he did. Uh, kind of overestimating Fiona's sanity with that statement. Being around you would make anyone nuts after a while. I'm starting to get that. I'm, I'm sorry, are you guys teaming up now? Because I kind of feel like you are. <laughs> Why did you choose Jack? When all of Pandoran recorded history would tell you, it's... A risky choice. We're talking about Handsome Jack here. He had a plan, plain and simple. Hey, I had a plan. It wasn't the greatest plan, sure, but it was better than trusting Handsome Jack. Being able to control the facility seemed like the way to go. You chose Jack, cause you're an idiot. There's no other explanation for it. <laughs> That might be true. I might have chosen Jack because I'm in I don't idiot. suppose there's a spare for the spare. Well, if there is, I'm not changing it this time. We're close. We can walk it from here. Where the hell is here? Yeah. And why is it where we are? I'll tell you when I find what we're looking for. Hmm. Wouldn't it be weird if this is the guy in the glasses? Or the girl. So, what happened next? <laughs> well, things started out fine. <laughs> Notice all the tattoos on his neck, too. Hail to the uh, king, baby! <laughs> this is like way in the future that they told you. Hey, kid! What are you doing? You mean, I'm controlling the drones? Yeah, well, <laughs> with my help, but yeah. Let's get killing, Cupcake. Reese? Come on, go on. Just standing through. here holding this grenade. 
Reese, what is this, buddy? You done shot? Just put it away. We have to get up there. Get us up there. Yeah. Sasha! Get us up there, Reese. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Come on, come on, let's go! Sasha, Vaughn! You made the right choice, kid. I'm really proud of you. Don't let it go to your head. Hurry up, Reese! Side, but I, it, it seems like it would be a good fit for you. Oh god, oh, 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 and a female bandit. Oh. I don't think we see female cool. bandits in uh, <laughs> Borderlands series. Here for equal opportunity killing. Go get him, Dumpy. I'm taking you with me, for some reason. This is so cool, right? D did you guys see me? I mean, how cool I was? <laughs> what now? Calm down, Sash. Can I have your gun? No, you do not need a gun. <laughs> At this point, honestly, let's just, you know, stay here. We'll have a nice cry, get shot in the face. Uh, you can get shot in the face if you want. Loaderbot can help! Ah, uh, duh! Hey, can you help us out? Yes! Lock of faith noted! <laughs> Whoa, buddy! Are you, uh... Your hands are... Re For the record, not my idea! <laughs> Get right in there, push that button. Yes! Friends of yours? Loaderbot! Pull up! <laughs> no, the Gordy's project. Valerie, 
the queen pin. Thanks. Don't mention it. <sighs> you the leader of this outfit? Hey, you all right there, buddy? I've had worse. That's right. What of it? Shiki. There she is. You remember me? Great. These jackasses. Oh, she remembers all right. Oh, yeah. You look, uh, different. I look different, because you made me look different. <laughs> yeah, man, she knows. She's messing with oh, you, dude. Right, that's enough. Calm down, Finch. She's the one who shot the shit out of me. Oh, yes, yeah, she did. Please, <laughs> just, just let me shoot that girl back in the in face. Get in the truck. Just You're time. being a nuisance. Me too. But, man, I didn't even... So what man, is it that you want, exactly? Me in trouble. Fee? Mmm. I see why you're Felix's favorite. Don't be surprised. I've known about you two for as long as you've been lifting watches. But I'm out ten million bucks... Because someone turned a simple deal into a complete shit show. Someone has to pay for that. <sighs> Looks like we have a couple new contestants. This isn't good. Okay, okay, I know how it looks. Things got a little messed up, but... Shut up! I'll deal with you later. I just want to say I had nothing to do with this. Uh-huh. Who's to blame here, Fiona? I want a name. Calm down, Hugo. No, no. Mm. I just look. Vasquez, he's the one to blame here. Did she say me? Really? <laughs> and none of this would have happened if he hadn't screwed up the deal. Oh, she's lying. She is lying, Valerie. Please, you have got oh, to yeah. believe. Oh yeah, and so will Vasquez. It's not my fault. Look, I know you're super pissed, but we have got the Gordy's thing, and it is going to get us a vault that is worth way more than ten million bucks, just like we told you. Everything is fine. We're fine. So this is what all the fuss is about. Yeah. Yeah. That's our little money maker. Huh? Then I guess I don't need you anymore. Nope. What? Kill him. No! Oh! Oh! No! No! Ah! Yep, that's exactly what I was shooting for. And people apparently die in this world. I suppose. I don't need any of you. <laughs> Cut her out of the deal. Make her head spin. Oh, come on. She won't Heads do up. that. Oh, wow. I thought it was a flashbang grenade. Uh, it is. That's not how it works. And that's not how it went. She put that gun in your face and you went all... Keep talking. The truth this time. Fine. But where was I? <laughs> you were in the middle of this. I was getting Gordis back. I've decided to call her. She has a shield, she's in red. Not here. We gotta go. This isn't over. You're the one leaving. Looks over to me. No. 
It'll feel much different than this. I'll let you know when it happens. Tell me, are you all just completely stupid? Yes. Someone gonna say something? Is this some sort of trick question? Cause I don't see... I am here to help you! You idiots! Oh. Where's the guy in the glasses? There he is. This is easily the most annoying contract I've ever taken. Oh, at least if it was an assassination, I'd have the pleasure of a kill at the end of it. Oh, well, I'm so sorry for the inconvenience. Who even hired you? A man named Felix. Oh. I normally don't divulge that kind of information, but he wanted you to know. What did he hire you for, exactly? Felix wanted me to pass along some knowledge, to mentor you, to help you survive. He felt you two had some untapped potential. Wow, you couldn't really have told us this earlier? It's not exactly something you scream down an alley when you've got Valerie's goons running around. My work requires some discretion. Oh, discretion. When you say that, are you referring to the part where you were chasing us through Hollow Point, trying to behead us with your shield? If I wanted to behead you, it would have happened. Whoa, don't be mad we got away. Thanks for stepping in with Valerie. Sure, don't mention it. Ugh. Look, I know you two have been through a lot, but I assure you I'm here to help. And I don't anticipate that'll be very long because when I feel the contract is filled, I'll be out of your lives. So let's just get through this. Well, welcome aboard, I guess. Thank you. So, uh, is he all right? Cause that's not normal. That's fun for ya. People just deal with grief differently. That's <laughs> different. Not sure it's grief he's feeling. Oh yeah, he's he's just going through some stuff. Hey! Huh. Don't do that. <sighs> oh yeah, I think I got something. What you got? I don't know, but I, I found out there's an on button somewhere. You've been looking at that thing for like 20 minutes. Well, it's apparently very small. We have no idea what this does. It could be a bomb for all we know. And it's not loaded in. In that. Initiating go to startup sequence. Energy chassis required for Vault of the Traveler protocol. Loading coordinates for energy chassis. Vault of the Traveler. Gortis activated. Happy birthday. Hi! Wow! Hey! Really great to meet you all. What is? Older than she looks. I think I was expecting something... different? I'm sorry if you're disappointed. You are the freaking cutest robot I've ever seen. Thank you! You're not so bad yourself. Meow. Awesome. Awesome! Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> oh, it was a awesome. robot this whole time! Yes, I am! That makes sense. Does that make sense? Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. Oh, cool! You got another robot! It's very nice to meet you. How is your day going? It's a mixed bag. That's great! Variety is so important. Gordis, hi. Hi! So, from what I understand, you can get us a vault. Absolutely! Now, I don't know every detail, but I was created by Atlas as a last-ditch effort to get to the riches of a vault, to get a leg up on those Hyperion guys. Well, we are still number one. Atlas had facilities all over Pandora, working on the pieces of me to get it done faster. But then, that lady made it a little more 
difficult to assemble by killing every Atlas employee. Well, uh, how many more pieces are there? No idea. But the next piece we need is... Uh... Oh! That'll work! This should be interesting. not coming. Uh, Gordis? Hmm? He is, um... Oh, shh. He's, he's resting. Probably for a while. Oh, okay. Oh, gosh. We'll just let him sleep then. <laughs> That's probably for the best. How come the guys are Hey, is there a video in this thing? Hmm. Feels like I could have lost one of the main secondary characters. There's a contradiction, main secondary color characters. Man, they are picking somewhat popular songs for each one of these episode intros and without fail YouTube says complains about that night and day driving around Trying to get the pieces. And some Jack. She's training her with the gun. So it's been a while. Are they progressing the time forward so that it will explain the differences in the way the two main characters look? Eggs on toast. Pong. Playing Pong on that fancy watch of this. There's their mask they collected. They're playing Dungeons and Dragons, basically. Scooter is helping him repair. They like the Gordy drive. Apparently, Handsome Jack is not coming back into the picture for a while. Oh, he got his shoe back. He lost that at the beginning of episode two. But there is music here on this intro. Now we're we'll getting to the ice area of Pandora. As far as areas in Pandora, they, it's mostly desert with a few ice places. It doesn't seem like you ever get into lush, like fruitful forests or anything like that. But there is some thought when Borderlands 3 comes about, it will be on different planets. Hey there, buddy. Just check it in. Don't want we'll to distract you from things, the different victory animals. laps. You're probably taking another Vasquez is dead, but uh, just checking that you haven't told Athena uh, about me at all. Have you? Why do you oh. ask? Why do you ask? Because if she finds out about me, she'll cut your freaking head off before you can even explain yourself. I'm not exaggerating. This chick's nuts. She... Really, really doesn't like me. Oh. Okay, look, kiddo. Stop calling me kiddo, please. Who are you talking to? Uh, I... <laughs> and... Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. But I mean it. She's really gonna kill us. Hey, what, what, what do you say we go to the room? Mossport? The nice, warm, vault hunter free room. I suddenly need to go to the roof. Wow. 
What does Athena know about him? Okay, Jack. You and I need to set some things straight. Oh, man. Can I just say, blasting those bandit douchebags in the tiny little pieces? <laughs> That's part of my day. I'm so happy. Thanks for giving me control of those drones, kiddo. So much fun. Uh, might have found it more fun if you hadn't tried to, you know, kill my friends. Did I? Sorry about that. Hey, must have got <laughs> caught up in the moment. And truth be told, kind of hard to tell friends from baddies out here. <laughs> you know, no. y'all kind of look like bandits. It won't happen I don't again. Believe you. You're right. It won't. But, yeah, I... but let's put that behind us, huh? It's time to look to the future. We're just two unstoppable, intelligent guys with great hair. Uh, you and I are going places, baby. High five! Why is that guy talking to himself? He's going through some things. <laughs> Tom! Come on. All right, I'll remember that. Left him hanging. What the hell is that? Was I able to hit the button? And I know I've done He's some kind of thing thing on the things, but we're a team here, kiddo. And you can even ask Athena. I always look out for my team, so I'm just asking you. Trust me here. We've got so much in common. We're both ambitious. We're both super hot. I blackmailed and murdered my way up the Hyperion ladder. You came up with that sick vault key deal. Huh? Hmm. So, being the bad guy working for Hyperion hasn't gotten us anywhere in life, really. So let's stop working with bad guys and doing the wrong thing. It's time to have a change of heart. It's time to do the right thing. Ooh, well, you're a genocidal maniac, so... No. Oh, oh that's a shame. And to remember because I that. Thought, <laughs> yeah, I thought we were becoming pals. Saved your life. Back there, and you still don't trust me. You know, I'm, uh, <laughs> I've had to deal with this my whole damn life, you know? Try to do the right thing, and people just crap all over you for it. Well, congrats, kiddo. You're the latest in a long line of jack shitters. Super psyched about it. Oh, and, uh, Pissing off the guy you're sharing a body with. <laughs> Pretty goddamn stupid. But hey, I'll see you around. So he's oh, that's surprising. There are new clothes. He has I didn't a know you had it in you. And he has tattoos on him. Guys, can we just call it for the night? We're not gonna find anything in this light. Of course, yeah. he's telling a tale right. here, so maybe he's lying when it comes to Handsome Jack. For all we know, Handsome Jack has completely taken over his body. Your mask. Hmm. What about it? It hides your identity. That is the definition of a mask, yes. What of it? It implies we would recognize you if you didn't have it on. Maybe it protects me. Maybe I just think it looks cool. Maybe I'm just crazy. Lots of possibilities there. Oh, I can tell you right now. It doesn't look cool. Noted. No, none of the lines I put you on make any sense without you either knowing us or needing us. It's compelling theory. How confident are you in this hunch? What I mean is, do you care to make a wager? I don't make bets when I don't know the outcome. Just thinking out loud. You should do a little less of that. Tell me about the dome. I'm done talking for a while. He can fill you in. Hey! What? Who wants to know about the dome? Well, the creepy part or the pretty part? All of it. All of it. And 
that's where we're going to end today. So far, so good on episode three. Uh, we were a little bit abrupt on meeting Valerie. Uh, I kind of wish we had done a little bit more with that. But overall, it's fine. Everything so far is so good. Uh, we have some mystery here. I'm putting my bet that it is actually Felix that is in there. But we don't know. It may be either secondary character, it may be Athena, it may be anybody. Anyways, that's it for this episode. As always, I ask that you like, share, subscribe, comment if you want to, and watch every second of my videos. All that helps out. If you want to support me, you can click on my name, Rido. On the right will be a blue button that says support this channel. If you want to friend or follow me on basically any social media site, there's a whole bunch of links down below. Thank you for watching. Have a good evening.